Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Today video I will try to explain how we can create Europass CV online. Let's start. Open your browser, just write here Europass CV and open your first link. Now you open your first link and you can see that this is our home page for Europass uh, CV, right? So. Uh, right now, I will not uh, log in or sign up for Europass account because uh, the process uh, is a little bit difficult and it's, it's really difficult to verify your uh, Europass account. So it's better don't need to be logged in or sign up. Just click on Europass and create CV. Now you can see that uh, you just click on a click new CV, create new CV, right? And now um, select your language data format and here you can see upload your picture here upload your picture if you want to add your picture here just upload your picture here just upload your picture here right so you can see that this is my picture fine save now just write right here your first name and last name here you just uh, have to write few lines uh, one or two lines three lines just uh, about your introduction about yourself right in a short form okay i will just copy some uh, some from here and i will paste here right you can see that this is uh, some uh, information about uh, my profile right you can add something you like and here you have to write your date of birth okay and select your gender male select your nationality your email and your phone number for example my mobile phone number i will write here mobile phone number work phone number you can choose by yourself here select your uh, country phone uh, phone number code because right now i'm in italy so i will write italian code okay and here uh, if you want you can add your social media like linkedin and and so on and if you have your website just add your website and here uh, just write your home address or work address i will write my home address here and I will write my address here and here postal code and uh, so here I will see uh, the city and corner and I will select the country right right now I'm in Italy so I will select the Italian address okay and I will click on save now you can see that my first part is completed now I will add a new section right now you can see that there are some options that you want you have to add your education training okay I will add my education and training here I will write my degree name okay the title of qualification awarded I will write here here I will write my uh, education uh, uh, like my university name and if you want you can write here address and here address if you want you can write uh, the university postal code and uh, city and uh, country China I complete my master from China so I write here China and if you want you can put the website of uh, your university and here you have to write your uh, starting date and uh, finishing date right okay I will just put some uh, dummy date for uh, only for your uh, demo so I completed start my 2070 and finish it 2090 okay it's just for uh, 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 demo right so uh, I finish in 2019 okay fine and i will click on save right now i add my master education if you have bachelor master and phd you can add education click on add education training you can add your another education right but i just add one to just for introduction just for a demo right if you want you can add your master bachelor and phd education what you want right and add another section i will try to add my work experience right I will click on aid okay here i will write uh, my work experience okay i will copy some data from here okay i will write for example i work as a technical consultant okay uh, and uh, and here i will write the uh, employer name okay this is my company name and this is a city i will write here the city name okay fine and a country okay fine now from from which date to uh, from and uh, end date okay i will write here for example i start from uh, uh, okay and then i will say okay i start from 
2016 okay to 2016 to 2017 right okay okay I start and I finish my job in 2070 right okay and then if you want you can write here uh, your responsibilities your activities you did in a during your work right okay I will write some responsibilities okay paste here and uh, okay so you can see that you can add whatever you want about your work and just click on save okay now if you want to add your another experience for example you work in two three companies so you can add, click on add and write your other company information if you want right so I, I just add one because I just for demo so if you want you can write what you like okay and add another section in this section I will write for example I can uh, write about uh, I can add my language skills I can add my organization skill project if you have a publication you can add your publication section too if you have a uh, hobbies and interests, you can write here for example I will write here digital skill right I will add the digital skills section for example I have a uh, experience in Java okay I have experience in um, PHP right and uh, I have experience in uh, Python okay and uh, I will write here for example uh, uh, scripting for example SQL and, and so on like you can add your uh, all the digital skills you have about your information and just click on save right and uh, add another section right for example I want to add my um, publication right okay click on add publication here write you here just write your publication title okay here I will write try to write my publication title this is my publication title okay uh, because you have to write your, your publication name and uh, here the year in which year you publish this paper and here you have to write for example URL it's just dummy URL but you can write your the URL of your paper right okay and then it's just dummy okay okay fine here you have to write the references and and that's it okay references means your the author list of author okay and uh, and just just write description if you want and save so this is a, if you want if you have a, a lot of publication three four five six you can add how much you want right so but I just add one and add and add a new section click on add new section now I want to add about uh, if I want to add about my project I can add if I uh, if I have a social uh, social activities I can add and uh, for example I want to add honors award because I get some awards so I will add some award for example uh, best student award award right okay so I will write here best student award from Beijing University and uh, you can write the dead and everything you want so you can add, add many information you want right so and just click on if you want you can write description here and save and for example I want to add the language skills language skill okay click just write here maybe your mother tongue maybe I'll write here Pashto okay and uh, add uh, okay I add Pashto is my mother tongue and here I will write other language for example English I know English right English and the select the listening level for example I have a C1 reading I have a C1 speaking I have a C1 okay so you can select this um, the your level of language just describe here and click on save right if you want you can add another language you know so okay and just add a new section okay again click on add new section now if you want to write about your uh, conference and seminar you can write here if you want to write about your project and so on because there are many information you want so it depends on you how much information you want to add in, in your resume or CV okay for me is fine I will uh, finish it this CV and then I will uh, now it's just for demo because I add some part to just let you know how you can create your CV online okay now just click on next when you click on next they will show us some template right 
you can see that it's loading now and uh, we will have uh, some templates here this is a uh, if you want add your uh, your your pass logo first page or every page if you want okay first page is okay and uh, do you want to add page number yes okay now the size of the page you want but i want medium so let's wait for a while because it's still loading okay now you can see that okay you can see that we have a uh, different templates first of all if you want you can e uh, put the uh, the euro pass logo on the first page only and you can add the page number right and it's, it's okay right now you can choose your uh, cv template right you want to cv your cv look like that uh, you want this template or you want that one so it depends on you for me i would like to add uh, this one right and now it's almost done okay you can cho choose the template and just click on next okay now write your cv name and just click on uh, pdf and click on download now you can see that our uh, europass cv cv is ready now just uh, open your cv and uh, you can apply for a job or phd research position where you want right okay open your cv now now you can see that your cv is almost ready you can use to apply for your job so see how beautiful is this uh, template and it's free of cost and you just you don't, you don't need to log in or sign up for this account just put your data on your own requirement and uh, you can get your cv so thanks for watching my video if you like my content give a thumbs up thank you